welcome back everybody to No Review Playthrough with Ryan and Danny. Uh, we've been gone a little bit on some vacation and so forth, so we're back home playing some of our games and thought we'd do a little bit more Marvel United today. So we've got Marvel and Wasp, Miss Marvel, Wasp, and we have Ultron. Okay, so we have to remember with Ultron, we have to take out the drones. Well, we have to do the everything we have to do is the threats. Okay, that was nothing special. We just have to do the do at least four threats or clear two of these. And these, you know, would help with the threats and so forth. So um So we just have to clear the threats and either rescue civilians or defeat thugs. Uh, is this one, the, two of those three things. Is this the most basic one? Uh, as far as villains, yeah, I think Red Skull is considered the most basic one, uh, and this one's the intermediate, and then I think the Taskmaster is the hardest one. All right, why don't you go ahead and shuffle Ultron's deck? Did Ultron go first? Yes. Yes, I think, so. I think the villain goes first. Okay. And how many cards do we draw? Four. Yes. It's been a little while since we've done it. All right, so go ahead and flip his. Okay, and there's one. Put villain dogs. Okay, so one to each side. And then okay, on his. Three? Yeah. Okay, so we have to do the overflow effect. Um, if this can be added to a location Add that token to the next location clockwise. Okay, great. All right. Definitely one that's there. Yeah, so I don't put it there. Okay. Um, that was escalated quickly. Yeah. Okay, and he did not land on a target. No. Okay, so that's okay, and there's no bam. Okay. All right. So. Marvel looks like she's. We have this is the one. I think this is the one character we have not played. So I have some punchies, and I have a wild. And we we took out the uh, the basic wild for the challenge makes us. So we're one card less, and we don't have that easy option of a wild. So we did the challenge that the game suggests because we haven't lost yet. So I figure at least doing that maybe give us a little bit more of a challenge here. All right, so what do you think? Um, it doesn't look like I have a lot of heroism ones. I don't think I do either. Okay, so we might... No, the good I thing have, about those is clear. A, I do have a two wild and I have a ability on a wild card. Okay. So. All right. Um, go ahead then. Okay. Um, draw a card first. Uh, draw a card. It doesn't really matter um, which order I do. So I move in a punch. Okay. So I think I'm just gonna... We gotta clear off these areas because if he only moves one or two again. I'm gonna punch here. Okay. And then move up. Move up there, okay. Yeah. All right, so. All right, so I'm gonna do this. I get your move and basically I have a photon blast that I can do two punches in one adjacent location. And just a regular. And so we'll go ahead and punch these thugs here for my photon blast. I have two more punches, so let's go ahead and punch this guy here. And then so... Move and a punch left. I still have a move and a punch left? Yeah. Okay, well I can't punch anybody here, so let's move and punch this guy. You have lots of punches. Yeah, she seems to be. Of course she's... And I didn't, I didn't draw a card. Okay. All right. You do that after. And, well, you're supposed to do it before, mm. but I always forget. Mm. Yeah. So you always end with four. 
All right, so we got one more card before the villain goes, or one more turn. Mm. Okay. So again, you're gonna get, you won't get the special, just the punch. Yeah. So we know he's gonna move clockwise and add to these possible locations. Yeah. So the question is, do you have punchies or heroism to rescue? Well, I only have one punch, and then I have my two water card, and then the two wild. Okay, so the Ultron vibes, we need to remember these. We haven't seen, these didn't affect us on the last couple. Heroes starting their turn in this location, ignore one symbol. Oh. You have to ignore one symbol. So it could be this one, or it could be... Okay, I'm gonna do two wilds. Okay. No, I'm just gonna uh, ignore that one punch. Ignore that one punch, okay. And then I'm gonna move up here. For one wild. For one wild, and then the other wild. Punch. punch. Okay. All right, so you ignored that one. Okay, all right, Ultron. doesn't move. No move, okay. Give one crisis token to each hero in Ultron's location and adjacent ones. Place slugs in each location without heroes. Okay, so we each get one because you're on it and I'm adjacent, so we each get a crisis token. And then place thugs in each location. In each location. Without heroes. Without heroes. All right, so here yeah. we'll overflow to here. Okay. Hero, so here, yeah, just one in each one of those. And then technically this one. Oh. Well, we did. Did we? Oh. That was the one that went here. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's the one that went there. Okay, so for me, I got two wilds. So I'm going to do my other photon blast. So I'll photon blast these two. Uh, I'm thinking about maybe... Photon blasting that clone. Mm -hmm. Well, You've, we've got to clear these off, otherwise they're just going to keep keep going. Yeah. All right, so photon blast, punch. So what I will do is I will use one of your wilds to move here, and then your last wild. Let's punch that. We'll punch that guy. Okay, all right, I still would have done that because there's lots of punching I could have done. Okay, all right, draw. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're better at it than I am. All right, so you'll have one punch from mine. Um, I need one thug left, so I don't need that many punches. We need to clear threats or rescue civilians, though, to move the game along. Okay. And we do lose if every spot has been filled by a thug or a villain. So okay. threats may not be the best thing for us to focus on. Yeah. Especially it looks like I have no heroism. So clearing these off. The big advantage we get is using the location's ability, obviously. Captain Marvel will not have heroism. Uh, she's stuck okay. up. Moving a punch. Okay. I'm actually just gonna punch with yours here first. All right, Let's so we clear this off. Okay. All right, we slide these down. All right, so now every two cards, so the Ultron will go next. Then, All right, so use my punch. And then I'm moving a punch. So I'm gonna go over here. Uh, actually, I'm. I would say punch this guy. Yeah. Just remove that threat. Because it looks like rescuing citizens is neither of our... No. I haven't seen a single heroism, and I still have none in my hand, so... Only well, uh, have the two I've seen. Yeah, so I don't know if rescuing citizens is going to be good for us. All right, Ultron card. Okay. All right, move one. Um, there is a target, but this does not have the target. And we place the civilian. 
three. Ugh. Barely. At least you have room for it. Yeah, we have room for it. We don't care about risking, and then one, and the next one. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna have a punch and a move from you. Yeah, I have no. I have no heroes. I'm okay. So let's go ahead and do a double punch here. Mm -hmm. So three punches, one, two here to clear out that threat. End of turn, you may discard one card from your hand to the bottom. Did I draw a card? No, I did not. I just did. <laughs> All right. That, well, that might have changed a little bit. Okay, so I did two punches so far. Now I've got a move and a punch, so I'm going to move and punch there. Okay. All right. until my next turn. Okay. And with the wild on it, so I'm gonna use that to move. And then your two punches, actually. Maybe not bad, never mind. It's not a bad one. There's nothing to punch. Yeah, there's these two. Yeah, but. Yeah, true. You don't need them. You don't need them, that's I'm right. I'm gonna use the one of these guys. True. So instead... Well, you're still gonna have two punches no matter what. So okay, do you have yeah. like a move to or a, you can move over to here. Yeah. I already used both my two wilds. Um, I have one move. Okay. Okay, I'll, I think I'll that's just your, stick with that then. I think that's your best bet at this turn. Yeah, it seems kind of dumb. Yeah, so I'm gonna move. And use my two punches, okay? At least it doesn't. Yeah, yeah it's not gonna go. add anymore. Yeah. Okay. All right, Ultron card. Here's a move again. Mm -hmm. Give one tri crisis token to each hero in Ultron's location and adjacent. Okay. Place Nothing. thugs in each location without heroes. Okay. So I'll start here. Okay, overflow that one, overflow there. So I think, let's see, we just did this one, right? Yeah. Okay, so that, technically we do this, which overflows here, which overflows to there. Mm. Then we do this one, which overflows all the way over to here. Mm. And then we do this one, which overflows to there. I think we covered them all, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right, draw. All right, so you have a wild for me. Okay, so let's go ahead. Again, I've got a third photon blast. Question is, do I hit that clone or the thugs? Yeah. I think. Because if he he's just gonna keep adding more, huh? I think I have to take out two of these guys. Okay. Otherwise, it's just gonna. It seems like he's just gonna keep adding more. All right, so there's my photon blast removed from an adjacent location. You have a wild and a punch left, so let's go ahead and move with your wild and punch one there. Okay. Hmm. Okay. All right, so you're gonna get a punch from me. Mm. And we're probably gonna have a lot of overflow on his turn. I only have two cards left. Yeah. yeah. I mean, 
mean, right now threats are trying to remove the threats as fast as we can remove the threats. Okay. We do have some thug control we need to do, but getting rid of the threats will help. Yeah, I punched that, yeah. Okay, Ultron card. Jiro again. Deal one damage to each hero for each crisis token they have. Then one hero of your choice takes one crisis token. Okay, so damage was discarding to the bottom, right? Yeah. Do that one, and then we each take a crisis. Or choose someone to. Then one hero of your choice takes a crisis. So I guess it says, well, it says your choice, so it's just, it's not necessarily yours or mine necessarily because we're both playing. Sure, I haven't taken it. I'll just go ahead. I'll take it. Okay. All right, so I'm going to have a move. There's one star. Let's keep those on. Just keep those. Just all right. So I'm gonna have a move. Uh, let's go ahead and let's do the double wild. I'll punch that twice. Okay. We haven't had a bam yet, have we? No. Okay. All right. Says you may rescue one citizen from this location. So if I stay there, I can rescue a citizen. I don't know if that's really good. Um, so I have a move left. Uh, I have a feeling we're gonna have to go down here and clear these off. Do these, is this threat? Oh, if he lands there, oh, we have to add another one. Okay, all right. Sure. Yeah, this might be our first loss. Yeah. Oh, we did clear up that. All right, so we need. Uh, I think we have the rest heroes is, for this. Yeah, the rest is heroism. We just kind of picked randomly. Uh, I picked Miss Marvel because it's one of the, the only ones we hadn't played. Kind of just picked Ultron randomly, and Danny picked Wasp. But yeah. I have one heroism finally. Okay. And you've had none, and we've used our wilds. I we still just... haven't used the two heroism that I had from the beginning of the game. Oh, yeah. Okay, go okay. ahead. Well, you're gonna have two wilds for me. Oh, yeah. So maybe move. So maybe I can, I can yeah. this one off if I... <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, I know it's hard. Use one of your wilds to move here, and then the two honors in a wild. Okay. For this. All right. Just clears that off. All right. Take the skull and put it on the there. Oh, uh, you may draw cards until you have three in your hand. At the end of the turn. <laughs> you have three. Yeah. Okay. So you moved, and then you used all three there to clear that. Okay. All right, well, the good thing is, okay. Well, the bad news is that Ultron's gonna go next, actually. So go ahead oh, and yeah. okay. do Ultron. Wow, he moves. Yeah, bam. Okay, so one, two, he's gonna hit there. Bam. Add three thugs to Ultron's location and deal one damage to each hero there. Oh. All right, so I will discard this for my hero. Is it overflow? That way? So O flows clockwise. Oh. So those two there, and then there. It's not the worst it could have been, I guess. One damage to each hero. Yeah, I, I, I dropped a card. All right, discarded. Okay, so I'm going to use my move and a heroism. So I will move here and use all three heroisms for this. Okay. Now we can do victory. Okay, uh, just there. All right, so the only advantage of clearing the third card off is you draw a card immediately. Did I draw a card? Yeah, I should have two, like you. 
There's my other two heroisms. Okay, so. The... And it says you may discard one thug from any location. Okay, so I moved to use my heroes. So my turn is done, so I'm staying. So chances are he's going to move. He hasn't moved barely at all. Yeah, he's hardly moved at all, so he might start moving more, which sucks now that we... It's only here. I can remove one from any location. Uh, sure. Chances are he's going to move one or two. I'll move that there. Okay. All right, your turn, and then he's going to go. So we can hit him now, and you're right there. Mm, Did we use all our fists? Uh, no, I, st I have one of each card in my hand. Oh, okay. I'm just... Didn't we? Mm. That wouldn't work. Uh, I'd either... Okay, I don't know so how that these... works. If I could use that on him. Even if I technically already am. In I would say no. Yeah. Says you can move to any location and punch there. I would say no. Okay. Save that because he's probably going to move. So I'm just going to do one punch. So that's the most I have. Okay, you do have a move and a heroism, which you don't need the heroism. Well, it's, if you end there, what happens? Um, you can draw cards until you have three in your hand. Mm. So, mm -hmm. it's a gamble whether you move or not, because if he doesn't move, you're in a perfect position to obviously try and hit and him then, again. But also, I could use that then. True. So I'm just gonna move. Okay. Yeah, I hate to hate and heroes and okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's not a bad choice. Okay. Ultron's turn. <sighs> oh jeez. Well turn he would be here then, right? Or um no, he's gonna go one, two, three, four, oh. five. Okay. okay. We removed the target threat, so he adds a thug. And a civilian here, which they all overflow, overflow. We just lost. Oh. Nope, well, nope, we got in there. But. Now we do. Now he puts <laughs> one there, overflows, overflows all the way to here. And then he would add two more. And then we lose. And then we lose. And that would, yeah. I would have been able to get two of them. Two of them on your turn? Yeah. Okay. And then Captain Marvel could finish you off. All right. Let's quickly reset and we'll do another one. Okay, go ahead and start with him. Uh, zero. Do one damage to each hero for each crisis token. Let's see. Um, if he starts there, we start here opposite him. Okay. Uh... Do you want those for each, to each hero for each crisis token they have, then one hero of your choice gets one crisis. Okay. Well, I took it last time, so. I like it. There you go. Okay. All right. Well. So I have, so now I know I've got three photon blasts. That's good. So right now we don't have a lot of thugs. I've got one right now. I do have two heroism, which doesn't help right now, actually. <laughs> so no. if you had a move, then I could move okay. on my turn, and then you add some heroism. Yeah. Do you happen to have your move and a heroism? That one you had before? No? Mm -hmm. All right. Actually, I have my one card. You may move yourself and any, any number of heroes from your location to any other location. Okay. So we could both move together, in other words. Yeah. Okay, I'm just wondering if I want to punch this drone while I'm here. But I can punch him this one because I'll be adjacent. And it also has a move on it. Okay, all right, that sounds pretty good. Okay, so, why don't you try that, yeah? yeah. So you can pick up both of us. Yeah. You may move yourself and any number of yours from your location. And we have a move afterwards, technically. Yeah. Okay. So why don't you move us here, and then I can punch the drone with my photon blast. Okay, and then I'm just gonna... Well, or do I use my heroism? Yeah. Okay, never mind, go mm -hmm. ahead. And then I'll move here. Okay. 
So all, that's just all movement on that one. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it didn't draw. All right, so I think I better use this while I'm here then. Add these two here. Um, I don't think I want to move. Because if I move, then I can't do my, it's harder to do my photon blast on either of these. I can hit either of those. So I think I'm going to skip your move. Oh, I didn't draw a card. All right, okay. I already had what I was going to plan. Okay. All right, we got one more. So your go, and then Ultron will go. Okay, I have my. So if you well, if you have some way to hit him twice, mm -hmm. let's save these oh, for the threat. Have four. Yeah. So if you have a way to punch him, then I can get him cleared. I have one punch. Uh, is it a move and a punch? It is. Okay. Because then I could move, use your punch, and then I've got three on this with a photon blast. Okay. So one, one punch. And then I guess. Uh, well, it depends on which. So I'm probably going to fight. You'll have some fight next turn. I'm going to move back. Move back to and here. one on her. Okay. And then chances of our hey won't bam us by jumping around. Yeah. Okay. All right. And then, oh, you have, you can clear off. Oh. Because you'll have yeah. two honor from mine. Okay, you may discard your hand to the bottom of your deck, remove one crisis token from anywhere. You are technically have the crisis token, it's not a location, but you could discard one card from your hand to the bottom of your deck. Two, two remove, okay, so we don't need to do that. Yeah. Okay, all right, Ultron, Let's see what he's got. Move four. Okay. One, two, three, and boom. With the bam. Okay. All right, so the bam, add three to this location. So one, two. Three threats. Two. And then the third will overflow here. And then. Now do we automatically, oh, and then bams, we add one to this location. Heroes in this location. Okay, we can't. And then add one, which we can't, so overflow that. Now, do we automatically take a hit with the BAM? Or he, he landed with us. Yeah. Or do we only do the effect? Activate the BAM, detailed on the villain sheet, as well as any... Bams on cards. Okay. So that technically does not necessarily automatically wound us. Okay. All right. So my go. Okay. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to photon blast this guy twice. Then I'll use your move to go here. All right. I stick, technically still have two left. We are way behind already. Yeah. Well, we're we're closer on the threats. Okay, all right. Uh, here's on this. Okay, so we weren't in that location to prevent that bam. Okay, so I did. I only need five. Two, more. three. You have one more. Oh, you're. I think you used it. What? Oh, your stuff. Cause... Yes, I think I did. Yeah. I did the photon blast twice. Moved. Punched him a third time. He only had three, and then I punched that one. So yeah. I'm done. Yep. Okay. Did I draw a card? No. Gosh dang it. <laughs> I don't know why that's so hard for me to remember. Because I already have what I planned, and I just go. All right. Okay. Oh, end of turn. You may move up to two civilians or thugs in any combination from this location. Uh, let's move one here. Chances are this is going to start overflowing. So I think let's try that. Okay. All right. So you have a punch from mine. Why can't I just punch Ultron now? I know. 
Okay. Because it'll be over within three seconds. That's too bad. That's how it should be, but... All right, we need to punch some thugs. Yeah. Too bad. No. We got one here. Oh. Okay, I have another moving punch. Okay. I'll punch one. Punch one of those. Yeah. Okay. Watch out. And then I guess another. Because of this one? Yeah. Okay, so two punches and a move. I'll go up here. Okay. Oh, I didn't draw. All right. I must have drawn because now I would draw. Because I should, unless we've taken any wounds, we should start with four. All right, so I'm going to get a move and a punch from you. I think I'm going to move, start clearing off some of these. Um, I can't move twice. Well, I could, but that's all I would do. I'm thinking about getting this guy out. Because I have no stars for now. Uh, okay, so let's do two moves and a punch on this. Okay. Um, all right, it's Ultron's turn. Two and a bam. One, two, bam. Oh, jeez. Okay, so he's gonna add three to the villain's location, which he can't. So he overflows, overflows, and fills. Jeez. Oh, great. Okay. Um, add one to this location. Location heroes in this location may prevent this effect if each of them takes a damage. both take a damage to prevent more overflow because yeah. it's only going to take one or two more cards I don't remember it being this hard when we played before managing yeah I think we just had good characters where we're getting rid of civilians and I think I don't remember I don't remember either okay all right so I'll draw all right so or no it's your turn sorry oh, yeah. it's your turn I draw you draw I have a feeling if we don't clear off some of these, he's going to just flood us. I'll do two wilds. Four. As much as I'd like to get rid of him, I can finish him with your wilds. Okay. I'll do two thugs there. Okay. You have a move. Oh. I'll go down here. Okay. All right, now I will draw. All right, so two wilds. So I have two double fists and a wild. And I'll save the wild, I think. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead and do these two and your wild. One of them yeah. to get rid of that. Okay, end of turn, you may move to any other location. So let's wild that one. And then move to a location. Boom. Okay, you got one more turn before he goes. So if we can clear out, clear out some of this. Again, if we have stars, now's the time to start playing stars. I haven't seen too. We haven't had too many. I only have one. Or wild. Which, um. Uh, and ooh. we've got a. Yeah, we've got a couple turns oh, left. Play that one. Okay. Punch. You're getting two punches. I'll use those here. Okay. No, because you're out of And then you got one more punch. Okay. All right. So if I can finish off that threat, which I can't because... Okay. 
So if we can finish the threat, then we can start hitting him. Okay. Um, oh, it's Ultron's turn. Uh, zero, give one crisis token to each hero in Ultron's location and adjacent ones. Okay, so that's you. Place thugs in each location without heroes. Okay. So here, here, thug, thug. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Do we do one here, technically? Since it's not here. Yeah, I would say so. So overflow it to your location. Yeah. Okay, so let's clear out those. Okay, so me. Okay, that's actually pretty decent. Alright, I have no thugs at my location, though. So I think my best bet. Few cards I have with hero on it. Heroic action. What's this? Uh, I have to ignore a symbol actually. We may have forgotten that. So I'll ignore the move symbol. <laughs> One of them. Add that for that. I will move for this one. I hate to leave that one. And then punch. So let's I'll put this here before I move, after I move. Okay. So if we end up staying. Yeah. Okay. Did I not draw? I was supposed to. Eh. Okay, it wouldn't have helped if I'd had the heroism. Yeah. Okay. So All actually, right. I. We got your turn and then Voltron will go. So our locations are not too bad. I think I can, I can get. So if you can clear that off, then we can start punching Ultram in the face. Do a shrink, so I can't take damage until the next turn. I do I can wild. If you do the wild there, I can finish that threat. Well, I can finish it now. With your oh, wild. you're right. So I can use the wild and the honor for, for this. Yep, okay. And you can draw a card so you have three in your hand. Okay, so the threat is done. All right, so now we can hit Ultron. And then the move, I'll move with Ultron. If he move. Okay, all right, Ultron. Oh yeah, we do two now. Every two. One. Perfect. Okay, one move, so go ahead and hop him over. All right, he adds one here, which overflows to this. One here. That's three, three. here. E it's gonna be close. <laughs> okay, so overflow, two. one, two, and then three. And then, and then he would add one, one here, there. which will overflow to there. Fair. Okay. Just kill him. All right, so since he's with me, ah. Okay. This, okay. Is that gonna be? Two punches? Okay, so what I'm gonna do, oh. I'm gonna punch him with this. Yeah. So I'll take out one from there. Then I'm going to use your wild to move. Unfortunately, um, I, can, I can do this, move, and then, and then punch him twice with my photon blast. Because I have the photon, now the, it looks like I have four fists, but I don't. I have to be. Yeah. Okay, so you have a chance to finish him before he moves. I can. All you need is a move. And then you were punch. Punch in the face. Oh, see, in that time we ended up with five cards <laughs> left. I had four. Since I was, I don't know. But. Well, yeah, because you played your fifth. Yeah. Well, you're, yeah. you have one extra turn than me. Okay, that's yeah. That's where really that's any honor. yeah. I have which one did I have? I had one card there with honor. Yeah, Captain Marvel. You have your two, 
So I have three, three on or total in that deck. So we, we pretty much had to use wilds for honor. Yeah. But that's the thing is I think if we hand pick our heroes, knowing which villains we're going against, I think it's almost too easy. There's a lost card. So I think it's kind of in this, in this game, at least for us that wants a little bit of a challenge, I think we have to kind of, well, we haven't played in, it's been a while since we played, so I forgot what each villain does. I guess if you looked at this, but I, I think it's important for us to kind of randomly do the heroes yeah. or, or pick the heroes and then shuffle the, it's kind of hard to shuffle them because they have backs on them, but you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, because if we hand, I think if we hand pick too much, because I think Captain America had lots of honor, so we could have been yeah. rescuing lots of citizen clean the threats because only two of them I are. I think that's how we did it last time with Captain America. I think with all the citizens and. You no, know, we played Cap and Widow first against Red Skull. I think it was our first game. I don't can't remember who we did. Have to look back. I'd have to look back at our videos to see which ones were there. All right, but yeah, I mean it's we took out the one wild like the game suggests. The other challenge is they suggest removing the double wilds as well. Um, I think that's a little bit. Is that's that? A little much. Is that well? So there's a challenge to remove the one wild. There's a challenge to remove the two wilds, and then there's a challenge to remove the th all three. All, I think that's all three. Oh. Or all or it's three, but I think it is all three. Mm. No. Because it says it removes the wild, which I have two wilds, two singles, and then a double. Um, one has a... You have a special ability on yeah. yours. So you could remove two full cards from the game, which means you only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine turns to, to complete the game. That, yeah, one day we'll try that. Yeah. Maybe the next one we'll try the, just the double wilds. Yeah. But yeah, I think... I, most people said taking out the wilds does make it. I mean, three cards, though, that seems. Yeah, that seems extra hard. Because that only gives you one, two. Would I, did I already count that? Was that the nine? Yeah. I think that was the nine. That one would be tough. Yeah. And then, then maybe picking the specific hero for the villain would not be so bad. All right. Well, thanks for joining us again for our playthrough of uh, Marvel United. Just a fun little quick game we've been enjoying. It's kind of nice to go through something nice, kind of quick and easy. Um, but we did have a loss, so that's kind of good. It is losable. Uh, but that was hard to focus on the citizens and the and those threats well, that uh, that required honor. So we had to definitely play to the strengths of doing the thugs and the clones. But even with that, that's only removing two of the threats. So we had to do at least two with the, the honors. Yeah. We could have really been in trouble at some point. All right. Well, again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.